So welcome back everybody to Web Gaming Central. We are, well, I am back from vacation and it is so cool because it's pretty awesome to come back from vacation and get right back to work and part of your work, which, well, I do have a 9 to 5, but the other part of work is fun. I love it. Gaming for the win. Anyway, so here we are and uh, this is our, well, we haven't given it a name yet, but Wessex Bend, and this is where we built our uh, solar farm, wind farm, metals, which, by the way, we have finished. Yes, we have finished. We sure have, and I think we're just about done out. We did go to the, to the um, other city with the education and all that jazz, or with the university, and we were uh, unlocking a whole bunch of things, and we did unlock this, of course. And I placed this in the last video, by the way. Um, toward the very end, though, in case you missed it. But these two wind... What are they? Tur turbines? Yes, vertical turbines. And they do make a big difference. And they... Actually, let's go back in there real fast. 170 compared to the bigger ones, which are about 60. So it's double the cost. More than double the cost. But the megawattage is more than double the megawattage so more like three times the megawattage so what I was gonna do is continue on replacing these which I don't necessarily have to do but um, I definitely want to do that be oh but wait a minute before I do that oh yeah I have more than enough money to do it okay so let's do it and replace this and it takes up less space as well another welcome addition or welcome uh, aspect of it all uh, yeah that's good that's uh let's go back and now we have 42 in X well once that starts going it's gonna go up actually so oh yeah by the way let's pick up the speed of this thing here there we go so now it's kicked in to jump 64.8 awesome okay so people uh, there we have it this city looks to be working just fine don't really even need the mass transit but I might just go ahead and do that because I said I would so let's see where could we actually place that probably around here on this road um, we have that but that's not gonna be enough so I'll place it here let me just see some uh oh Right, that was the other thing I was going to work on, the school, but I wanted to make more money first, which I can do, but uh, such an expensive thing to add the high school, but it will take care of this problem we have here, that is for sure. Where is our school? Actually, another thing that will take care of it is if, and, oh, where's our other school? Right here. Oh, this is maxed out, though. Is it? No, it's not. So we was it maxed out now it should be maxed out um but i still am going to need a bunch of cruise books there but i'm going to need mass transit and more education and more education so let's start with mass transit i think do i have bus stops? yes i have bus stops all over the place we have those buses coming in from the other city so i don't really know if it's really and look at that they gave us a time on it which means it's recognizing that we have buses helping our city out so as a result I'm really not good that's a waste of money I think to place oh that is another thing well, I got that there uh, do I have enough clearly not that's better and we don't even have a whoa didn't even realize okay so I just must have very recently placed this all right so there we go all right well that's a lot of money yikes um but we needed a, a police station so what i'm gonna do is just wait a little bit wait a little bit before we uh, jump into that high school because yeah um <laughs> this holds 950 now that's better but it's not gonna solve our problem at all. Uh, well, looks to me like uh, it needs to, the city needs to grow a tad bit more before we 
drop that high school, which will help. It's not imperative that we drop the high school now, but eventually it will be quite imperative. We have a lot of money, true. And I really could do it and still be profitable in this city, of course, but not quite something I want to. To me, I like to be in the black. As it said in the counting, I know somebody mentioned that to me. But I like to say green because it's color green. So I just go for it. But, you know. And I do have an accounting background, actually. So pretty uh, well versed on jargon and terminology. But, uh. Look at there. This side is kind of sprouting up here. But this is commercial, isn't it? Yes, it's all commercial. Not bad. Not bad. That's not my downtown area. Let's see. Oh, I'm in the, I'm in the red. Oh my god. Oh, I was going to put commercial over here. Is there a demand for it? Not at all. Not at all. Another thing I wanted to see. Ooh, right. That's why I didn't build anything there. Hmm. Or there. Okay. Well, fair enough. What do we have here? An upgrade. Ooh. You know, it's funny. I do love the fact that, you know, when you unlock things for the uh, city hall in one city, it will unlock it for the region. Most modules. I think all of that. Uh, all of the modules, actually. But anyway, the point I'm making is that I don't know. I, I don't know if it takes away from... Because now I find out that after... Within this region... After the first four cities, you know, placing the modules for the whole region in those cities, I find myself not doing anything with the city hall anymore. And it's logical because it's absolutely no reason to build any of these modules because it, it takes money from you. 500 an hour, to be exact. And if you already have these functionalities unlocked, then it makes your city hall boring. At least in the city, in this city, or in the city that I don't need it, need the modules. So, I don't know how they can rectify that if they even want to. I mean, it's a small thing, a very small thing, so maybe it needs no attention, but I was just thinking about that, you know. I really find myself totally ignoring City Hall now that I've uh, pretty much built almost every city in this region. Um, let's see here. Okay, so let's take a look at some of these uh, here things. Unfilled jobs. Oh my god. You know what though? I'm not going to be too bothered with that because. Ooh, I need some more commercial. Commercial? They're in need of commercial. Um, I'll tell you what. Let's see the land value. Well, well, maybe I'll put some over here. Yeah, let's let's try that. Well, I meant to get rid of that layer. Okay, let's try this. Let's see. That doesn't have now, this is only gonna make things really clogged up even more. Which is why I, I think it might be a good idea for me to connect this road here. And yes, it will be. No, no attaching to the guides. Looking for awesome, it's gonna kill traffic even more, probably. But at least these folks can make the turn earlier than coming way over here to make the turn in there. So, to me, it makes sense to do this, do it this way because um, otherwise, that's gonna be a little bit crazy. Not so bad, okay? Yeah, that cleared up things quite a bit actually. Because now they're going to use this, this is going to become the bottleneck to a degree, but it's going to really pretty much alleviate a lot of issues because you got people coming from over here and the work jobs here, and then they're, you know, getting backed up here because this was the only road into this area. So now you have two access points. Makes traffic dissipate. Yes, that did work. Awesome. So now these folks can get to work a little bit faster. A little bit faster. Cool.
Yeah, and see, these guys were trying to get to work too. And, right, so that was just really creating a crazy bottleneck up there. Anyway, so, um, yeah, my hourly rate is really ridiculous. Well, it's not really ridiculous, but it's, you know, in the red. To me, that's ridiculous. So, I have to fix that. But I, um, let's take a look at everything. Again, 87, oh, that went up. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. That's good. Um, hmm. Oh, yeah, I gotta wait for a 24 hour period. Only 680, huh? That's a problem. 37 minutes on the boats. Okay. Um, so, at this point, I don't know. I think, um, I mean, there's definitely things to do and definitely things to address, but I have to wait. Because I don't want to build too many more homes. I didn't want to make a full, full city. I just wanted to... Oh, yeah, that's really slow. I just wanted to... Um, you know, nice small city, really. And I think I achieved that. But now... Um, it's asking me, whoa, where did that come from? Parks, power, city specialization... You see, I did all this with just a 9% tax rate. Wow, and just like that, profitable. Just like that, profitable. So, well, I guess that's an answer to that problem. Now I could actually effectively place the school and solve a whole lot of problems. So let's go ahead and do it just to make this city complete. Let's complete it before I do that. Oh, man. Yep, I'm going to place it here. All right. Okay, so wow, and these guys are gonna cost me a hundred a piece. Don't need a ton of those though. This guy, gymnasium. Across the way, classrooms. How many do we have now? Can hold eight hundred. <clears throat> yeah. Oof. Ouch. Ouch. Yeah, we're going to stop right there. Right at the line of profitability there. Okay, so, now that that's there, education problems should be history. Should be a thing of the past. Let's, they won't update, update right away. But, um, yeah, that should solve a lot of problems. But we're back in the red with a 10%. Um, yeah. You know what? Yes, we do need bus stops over here. It's part of the problem, I suppose. Alright. Got those guys. Yeah, they got bus stops. Okay, everybody has bus stops. Awesome. Okay, we're in the hole again, but that's alright. Like I say, we have the shipments um, from coal and ore going out and metal actually which is going to did I actually address that I think I did these are these two and we're exporting those still really didn't even know that we're exporting the metal and the alloy great my question is should I just focus on using this locally I think so Prices went down for that in particular. Let's see here. Yeah, that's good. That's good. That's good. I see those keep going on too, but you know, again, I think we can live without that. So just let those, um, let the coal and ore just, you know, cycle through the city, not be exported. And then we'll just export the alloy and metal. So this should be full because now it's going to be focused on. Um, you know, being stocked up from the, you know, our own city. Just want to watch that for a little bit. Let's see how fast they get those here. While I'm doing that, actually. Yep, I just got some. When I do that, I can see the trucks. That's why I go to this screen. By the way.
Yeah. Being used pretty quickly too, though. So, or we're just gonna come from here. Should be coming rather quickly. Yes, should be coming quicker than that. Oh, come on. Oh, is that it right there? Why in the world would it be way over there? Holy moly. Wow, why did it take that long t Yikes. Just come this way, dude. Thank you. Makes life that much more easier. Holy. Thank you. Fill her up. Okay, no. Don't fill her up. Go take the scenic group. Where is that going? Oh, I see. Sometimes it comes straight from there. So I really don't even have to because it will use it locally, naturally. Because some trucks came right from here to here without stopping there. But they're going to come from here too to stock this, clearly. Did it have any there? No, they emptied that out. They're still producing. Do we have a loaded? Yes, we do. do what? Oh, good. We're making profit again, too, by the way. Yep, that's full. No. Um, right, so this should not be running out at all. We're making pretty good money from that, though. So, everything looks good, guys. Uh, let's check uh, the education again. It's still going to be low, which is awesome. Uh, yes! Cool! More students are enrolled, and that's all because of our school. Awesome. But now we don't have a lot of workers. They're hiring, though. This one is not hiring. That's not hiring either. Of course, they're not fire workers, but that place higher. It's fine. Alright, guys, so we're going to jump out of this city and get things uh, rolling in um, our last city, I believe it is. So let's go ahead and uh, take a step back. We have two more cities, don't we? Um, no, we have one more city. So let's run over there. Okay, so here we are, everybody, and this is a, <laughs> it's pretty crazy, this is the last city, uh, no, where is, there we go, that's what I was looking for, alright, very last city of our region, this is a pretty, pretty amazing, uh, not, you know, anybody can finish a region, but, you know, for me, I just feel pretty good, because we really paid a lot of attention to each of these cities. And here we are, the last one, to complete the whole thing. And we're going to do the best we can for that. Now, I did say this is going to be our electronic city, so we're going to get focused on it right away as best we can. Uh, the truth is, I can actually send a gift here to make life a little bit easier. So let's do that. Do that right away. Send about 800,000 simoleons to get us rolling and again for this one I don't know I might even import uh, alloy and and uh, oh you know what I should have got things rolling first whoa hello you know what one second guys. okay what I need to do first is establish the city and I don't think it really matters that greatly but I just wanted to make sure I didn't, uh, you know, mess anything up. So I'm gonna do. Let's go ahead and get it started. I like that actually. That's pretty neat. All right, let's go ahead and uh, throw down this. Uh, oh, I can't do that just yet. So let's get um, some things going here. Um, here's the fun, interesting part because. Do the lock 
Hey, it is a long line, folks. Oh, you know what? All right, it just looked like it was curving, but it wasn't. All right. All right, so here we go. Oh, what is that? A who? Whoopsies. Did I go too wide for that? Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, probably did, but that's okay. Uh, yes, I did go too wide for that. Tell you what. Um, I'm gonna have to cross this. I'm gonna cross that like that. I know you're probably saying, dude, yeah, but. Yeah, but. I'm gonna let that go. Uh, let's see. I'll let that go. This one, we are gonna do it right. Right distances, I guess. Alright, so what I wanted to do. Can I get it yet? Not yet. Gotta provide power and such. I'll tell you what, though. Yeah, I can do that easily. Uh, yeah, we're over here. Haha. <laughs> power to sell. Yes, they do. Come on. Be nice. I'll buy such. Buy something from around here. Alright, they do have power, man. Such jerks. Anyway. <laughs> um, just to get us going. Uh, just to get us ruling. Um. All right, there we have it. Um. Like that. I can place none of that stuff down yet. Uh, Alright, so can I now place this? Alright, I guess we have to get. I always forget this part. You gotta wait until um, working power. Yeah, waiting on this. I love that now that you can choose whether to sail to neighboring cities and whatnot. And maybe that's what my problem is. Turn that on. So there we go. Place this. And I'm going to place it right there. But before we continue on, slow things down a little bit. Now I'm going to take that trip over. Yay! Can name my city to something other than Tudor Isle. That's okay. So, be right back, guys. Hang tight. Okay, so now let's just do this. Oh, and before I go, that's set to sell. That's set to sell as well. But we're not selling. Doesn't matter. Let's just uh, send the money. Send the money. Let's send ourselves. Send us. Okay. Send that gift. Speed up the. Okay, so he's coming to get it, I suppose. No, is that it? I don't think that's it. Yes, that's it. Right. Yes. Right. If I can never. Oh, he came and got it. Good. 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 Alright, down to 1.04. So let's load it up. Roll on. And here we are. Awesome. So let's go to this so we can see the transaction happen. Right. Ooh, lots of simoleons. Five million. Five million. <laughs> anyway, so come on, hurry up. Drop it off, folks. Give me those simoleons. Come on, today. Okay, I guess you don't show me going to get it anymore. Come on! Alright, tell you what. Let's just get back to what we were doing. Alright, pick up the speed. Alright, so the idea. Let's see, how do we want to do this? Let's see, how do we want to do this? How do we want to do this? I think we want to do these this way. Uh, let's see. Uh, where? Oh, yeah, duh. Here. 
Let's see, first what we need to unlock. Here we go. We need, ooh, it's already unlocked for me. I wonder why that is. Huh. So that's telling me I can actually start importing chips if I wanted to. But I don't want to do it that way. Okay, so there's going to have to be a bit of education here, that's for sure. What I'm going to do is uh, create a little uh, IT section of the city. A little small one, though. Just a small one, enough to get me five buildings. Or maybe a few more. And, and if I'm not mistaken, I'm going to put that right back here. It's facing right over to that city, isn't it? And no matter really where I put it, it's going to blow that way. So let's see. Still haven't gotten that money yet. That's okay. That's okay. Alright, so I'm gonna assist on this small road. But I'm gonna pick it up here. We're gonna go to a bigger set of uh, buildings. A little uh, broke there. <laughs> yes, need a little more smoothies. Alright, so it'd be nice if that uh, deposit would come, you know. It would be awesome. But uh, we're running out of time on this video. But what I'll do, of course, tomorrow there'll be another one coming. Um, we will finish building this city. And we can probably move fast, given that that money should be here any day now. But, um, uh, any sim day now. But yeah, so the idea will be to place a little bit of um, medium tech industry there. Just enough to get us to unlock this. Then we can start producing chips. But in order to do that, we're going to have to bring in some uh, some alloy and, is it alloy and, it's not plastic, is it alloy and metal, I believe. I could be wrong, it could be plastic. But I'm going to place this, once I have enough smoke, I'm going to place it there. Alright, so, what are we already about to run out? Hey, we did not buy some. Oh, uh, yeah. All right, so we should be good. Oh, really? Ew, not cool. All right, let's just throw that there. Who cares? All right, so guys, at this point, we're going to stop the video here. We're going to come back tomorrow, and we're going to continue on building our last city in the region. I'm um, still thinking about what I'm going to do after this region, and uh, we'll... Uh, Hear your thoughts there, uh, but I also want to throw this in there. I'm going to probably make a video for this separately, but um, Splinter Cell will be coming out soon. Grand Theft Auto 5 will be coming out soon. If you guys want to stay tuned to watch the Let's Plays of those, please let me know. In particular for Splinter Cell, let me know what type of gameplay you want me to do. I think they have the, the um, you know, for lack of a better term, I forgot the terminology, but I know it's uh, Panther style gameplay. I guess you're, you know, really being sneaky. I think that's what that one is. And then you got, you know, Guns Blazing. I forgot you call that one. And then there's another one I think is more tech-related. But let me know what your thoughts are on that. If that's a game that you're looking forward to. And um, awesome. Thank you. I will see you guys, of course, in the next video.